Hi y'all. Hi YouTubers. Hi. I know some of you are gonna get on the tube right away. <laughs> so, as I promised, this is another live video I'm doing. So, I'm just gonna wait for some of you guys to um, see this. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, one of you is already there. Two of you are there. <laughs> well, today, right here in California, it's a very rainy day. <coughs> Sneeze. Hi, um, um, Yuzzy. Hi, uh, Music Box. Hi, um, so look at the rain. Yeah. Why did the chicken cross the road? Can any of you answer that question? Why did the chicken cross the road? <laughs> That's funny. Hi, um, Olsen. Hi, um, um, Queen. Hi, um, so, this is my house. Yeah, I know it's a little messy, but right now, I'm trying to, hi, um, old school log, log or whatever. Uh, oh, anyway. <coughs> So, um, it's a very rainy day right now. That chicken, <laughs> to get out. Yeah, why did the chicken cross the road? I'm doing a little bit of laundry right now. So it's really raining out here. So I'm gonna go get this umbrella and I'm gonna hang out in the garage. So, hang on, okay. Low battery? Who has a low battery? <laughs> this phone, I think this phone is water resistant. I'm not sure though. Well, hi, um, uh, Micheline. Yeah, well, it's raining right now. It's been raining in the last few days. Here, I'm gonna try to fix this. Shit, I'm trying to make adjustments here. And so today, I actually rode this bike in the rainy weather. I rode for like 10 miles in the rainy weather. So, it was cold. Well, anyways, <coughs> some of the things I acquired, my mom gave me this treadmill. And it needs a belt or something because I have it taken apart because I needed to fix that. Well, anyway, so. Yeah. Now it's raining all over the car. Oh, man. It's cold out here. I'm going to go back in the house. It's too cold. Um, raining while here, there, snows, and New York State, huh? Still raining. Yeah. So, anyways, I'm gonna go back in the house. I'll leave the garage open though. It's too cold out here. I have to go back in the house. It's warm in there. And so. So, <clears throat> garage, I mean, that garage door, I need to fix the garage door because it doesn't want to operate properly. So, anyway, so what else do you guys have to say? <coughs> 
So I'm gonna have one of these right now. Looks like a um, cupcake. I don't do a lot of these. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I'm trying to catch up with the comment. Did you, did I ever visit Florida? Nope, never. Nope. Well, you know what? <clears throat> the, the only other places that I ever went <laughs> yeah, you're right, huh? Old school, huh? I mean, old, old kids. Lounge. <laughs> so, <coughs> uh, that I, uh, my mom also gave me this computer here. It's a, um, it's an older computer. This is an HP, um, DV6000, and this one has Windows Vista, and that and this is now starting to become old. I mean, what I mean is starting to become a vintage now, <laughs> sort of. Well, I was trying to see if I can upgrade this to a Windows 10, because they still do Windows 10 for free, but... No, oh, sort of, but I'm not worried about that, though, really. What kind of VCR did you have in the 80s? I had a... Let me see, I had a... You had, who had one? Oh, you had one like this? It's a, it's a Windows Vista. I mean, I actually liked Vista. But anyway, uh, what kind of a VCR? I had one that was... Branded, multi tech. It was like one of those, uh, one of those generic branded VCRs that my mom bought us for Christmas years ago, 1985, and it was 228 dollars. And then later on, we had a, um, we had a, um, <coughs> what do we call it? It was a Sharp brand VCR, and that was pretty good, you know. Well, anyways. This computer, this one has, um, this one has uh, the specifications on this one. This is from like 2007 or 2008. It's already 11 years old, but it works. The batteries are no good on this stuff, but I mean, this one, I mean, I think with the research, this computer, you could probably get it for like maybe 50 bucks now, maybe 75. So imagine that, you know. Shit, I would have killed to get one of these in the 80s. <laughs> I'll tell you, did you ever own a laser player in the 80s? Or a video player, VC? No, I never owned that. I didn't own any laser discs or, or, um, I mean, I didn't own any sort of video players, video CD or DVD or laser disc players of any kind. My very first uh, disc type players or disc type was was um how I call it. It was in two thousand three when I started doing them um, DVDs when I started recording on DVDs and stuff. <laughs> So, uh, remember the the computers I had the home screen, the home button? Remember these? <laughs> what was the first cell phone you owned? Well, the first cell phone you got, oh, yeah, you got a VCR. Yeah, well, you can get VCR for cheap these days. My first cell phone, it was a, um, it was a, um, how we call it, um, I had an Ericsson. Well, I actually made a video of it the other day. I mean, I had an Ericsson phone, and it was it was like one of those like very basic phones, you know. Yeah, but I, I mean, I liked having a phone though. You know, back I liked having a phone that we can 
that was portable, you know. Let me see. Okay, I'm trying to see. Let's see. I'm trying to get the specs. Okay, control panel. Remember, we used to be able to do this before. We can't even do that with the Windows 10, but, well, we know where to go, but system and, yeah, so, system, remember this? System, well, this computer is a, uh, this is the specs of this computer. It's a uh, Pentium memory, and it actually has some memory in there. And 170. Well, anyways. I mean, by these days, we could get something like this for like 50 bucks now. Or 70, maybe 75, you know. Well, I know this one, like... I mean, the screen doesn't work good. If I if I move it, it's gonna stop working. But this computer, we can like, if I were to sell it, I would probably be selling it for like thirty bucks or some. But can't imagine that thirty bucks for something that would have cost millions back in nineteen eighty eight. Not like this computer here. Well, anyways, yeah. <clears throat> so, so what else? What else do you guys have to say? Oh yeah, I'm gonna show you the. Let me see. I'm trying to. Oh man, I'm trying to, I didn't get the comments. Hang on. Some your mom must have a, had a decent job. And well, my mom um had a um. My mom had um, Bank of America. She was just a Bank of America employee there, you know, back in the day. And then she was like a loan officer at one time, you know. But she she's like not working there. She retired, you know, years ago. Do you know anyone who had the large brick phones? Uh, you know... I didn't know anybody who had one. I mean, I, I never actually had any friends or... Ne I never came across someone who had one of those, you know, like those big cell phones. No, ne I never knew somebody. Let me see. Burner laptop. Huh? People buy burner laptops to go on Darknet? Whatever that is. <laughs> well, anyways... So, yeah. Hang on. Is your wife Filipina? Yep, she's Filipinas. Yeah. So, this is my Rubik's Cube. Just another one I have. And this is my hard drive right here. This is where I have all my current stuff. It's a four terabyte. So. <clears throat> okay. Where is your family originally from? Well, my family? Are you talking about... If you're talking about um, my mom and my dad, well, they're from Mexico. And well, all of us were born here in USA and in California. All of us kids, Hector, Arnold, and me... Cynthia, we were all born here in California, but my dad and my mom were from Mexico. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm not, I'm not sure of the story, but I mean, whatever. I mean, I'm here, so, anyways, so what else? Yeah, my family. Yeah. So it's still raining out there. Oh, that's the washer. It looks like we have some of these alerts threat. Because it's a flash flood. 
This is another line, another phone line that I have. This phone, you know, paid 50 bucks for this one. This is like one of these cheap ones. But imagine that, you know. This phone right here, if I was going to put this for sale, probably get like 20 bucks for it, maybe. <laughs> probably, probably worth 20 bucks. But imagine this, you know, this phone tw at $20. Is about is literally about a thousand times better, better off than this computer that I showed you guys the other day. Yeah, imagine that. How things changed over the years. Funkish, huh? funky. <laughs> I don't know what you said. <laughs> well, anyway. Would you ever go back and relive? I'm already back in the 80s. <laughs> just kidding. Well, I can go back whenever I want. You know, I just watch my videos, you know. <laughs> it's fun to relive my 80s. It's fun to pretend that I'm in the 80s. You know, like I like to use my VCR and stuff. You know, right here. Like I, I have a VCR and then I like to use all, all my 80s stuff. You know, like I have my... Uh, radio cassette recorder and vcrs and cassettes i mean it's fun to to be in the 80s you know there's another comment right here cool me too grew up in the same way that as you bring it back now that's pretty cool that's nice rafael bravo <laughs> yeah yeah you're i see you on facebook too that's nice. Crazy, that's a mix that would have been the possible. But I didn't get what he said. That would have been possible for the most of the time, except for the last 60 years. <laughs> well, anyways. <sighs> yeah. So. Do you remember September? Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I actually even made a video. I actually even um, posted a video up uh, regarding that time, you know, that September 11th thing, you know. I posted a video of where I was and my reaction on it. Yeah. So. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, I had to burp. That's what I do a lot of, you know. I'm always burping, you know. So, did you go up in the mountains a lot with your friends? I saw a video or two of those days. Well, mountains, well, if you're talking about during the 80s, well, I used to go to the, yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. During the 80s, well, I, I did not used to go up there. I mean, it was only that one time, but I used to like to ride my scooter that way. I mean, going up the Azusa Mountain. Uh, live footage or later? What? What did you mean by that? Uh, let's see. Your family is a mix. <laughs> no, well, I think my family? If you're talking about my immediate family, well, yeah, we're a mix. But if we're talking about my mom and my dad, we're Mexican. I meant during the 80s. Yeah, the 80s. If you meant, yeah, during the 80s. Well, I used to love to ride my scooter. Going up that, I used to love to ride my scooter there, you know, in the mountains or like going up those hills. And here's a video of me, um, I was outside in the rain just after coming home from riding a bike. Hang on, let's Flower, you recorded the flowers were burning on later on. The top, well, I mean, I record, I mean, I, I just record the news, you know. Well, anyway, see, this is a video that I made of me getting wet in the rain. <laughs> Batteries died on my camera. But anyway, I'm going to play another video. Here's another video. See, this is me riding the bike in the rainy weather. <laughs> with the GoPro on my head. 
Gone. Oh. That was pretty daring there. What GoPro? Oh, you're talking about the. Well, I use the um. I just have some Acaso brand. You know, it's not. It's not a professional brand. It's this one right here. I'll show you right now. It's this camcorder, or it's this one right here. This is something I paid like eighty bucks for, but it came with all the accessories and stuff. I mean, it it, it does its job pretty well for being eighty dollars. You know. Yeah, I mean, it's like, I had a GoPro, but I ruined it at the Philippines. <sighs> it's me riding in the rain. Let me see. 92. Do I have any videos of the 92 rides? Not really. I mean, not, not even really the news either, but I think I did at one time, but I mean, I don't know what I did with the tape. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's not bad, man. Am I retired? No, I'm not. <laughs> Cold if I want to. Nah, just kidding. Well, anyway. Well, I mean, right now, I'm, I'm just kind of like a stay-at-home dad. Because Jenny Lynn likes me to stay home. Because she wants me to be available at any moment's time to pick up my kid or any emergencies and stuff. Or since she can't drive, you know. Hi, um, Marshall Films. <laughs> I want to go to work, but I mean, but like I said, like I'm always having a situation of, I mean, like who's going to pick up my kid or take care of kid or whatever. But, you know, Jenny Lynn likes me for me to stay home, though. He, he, be, he, what? Any tips from... <laughs> Oh. Yeah. Well, yeah. Jenny Lynn was calling me right now. Do I listen to freestyle music? Yeah, I listen. I listen. I still listen to the old, old stuff here and there. I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm not really playing a lot of music these days, but I mean, I do hear hear music here and there, you know. So this is me riding my bike. Oh, thank you. I bet you love my videos. Uh, I can't really pronounce that name. Uh, hmm. It's hard for me to pronounce your name. Sorry, but well, thanks. Thank you for your comment. Yes. Uh, <laughs> you can work from. Yeah, I mean, Jenny Lynn gave me the idea too. Working at home. I think I should try doing that. That's okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, anyway, see that? That was, that picture on the computer there, that's my... That's from my drone. Yeah. Let's see, what do I have? What's this video? Ah, that's the video that I made the other day. Hesperia, California, huh? Am I enjoying the rain? I am. I love the rain. I love the rain. Oh, yeah. I always like the rain. <laughs> so I'm going to play another video right here. There's me going home after the bike ride. Uh, a friend request from Facebook. I have to. Uh, that's me writing the book. That girly just like uh, walked in front of me, you know, like, and I was, I was not expecting for girly to just suddenly do that. Well, anyway. 
me riding the bike home. So, <laughs> I'm probably gonna go to the gym later on today. So, yeah, hey, it was really raining out there too. But I had the, I had the. Ran over and over. Because I had started taking off on my bike and then suddenly she just ran into my way. <laughs> well, anyway. So, what else? Why? Anyways. There's me going up that hill on Little Mountain Road. Pretty tough. But, you know, I mean, that bike that I have, it's like I don't, the gears, I don't have low enough gears to be able to scale that hill. Because with the other bike, I'm able to scale the hill with it. Because I have, like, ultra-low gears. Well, anyways. So, this is me. See the cloud? I mean, the... Well, yeah. Well, anyways, so what else? So I was using this camcorder or this uh, GoPro. Not bad. Well, anyways, just gonna walk around the house a little. Oh, hell. Well, anyways. So, what else? I'll continue with this video probably maybe 10 minutes. Then I'll probably make another, and then I'll make another one of these. Probably maybe later on today or so. It's just so that way everybody can get a chance. Well, anyways. Old. There's the chickens that crossed the road again. <laughs> Anyways, accents are nice. I'm enjoying them. <laughs> I'm telling you. Right. So uh, what else? Oh, still cold in here. Even though I'm in the house, I have to turn on the heater. So, what else? I'm trying to think of what else to. Uh, hmm. Oh, yeah. Telling. I'm going to show you guys my surveillance camera systems. Okay. I'll show you the examples of what of the things that I can do with this. I'm going to have some popcorn. You want some popcorn? Hi, um... Hello, Rory. Hi, Michael. La la la
Okay. This is something from earlier today. This is overnight. That was earlier today. Hi, um, L.A. City. A normal guy? What normal guy? Where? <laughs> Hang on. No, see, this is earlier today. No, no, no. When did I actually take off? This is me, um. <laughs> this is me, um. Walking around in the rain. <laughs> I'm all washing the car in the rain. Hey, Gil, do you know who Elton John is? I know Elton John. He's, like, from the 80s, you know. Um, yeah, I mean, I like his, I like some of his music. That's me driving into the, that's me moving the car, my Kia, to the front. That's a good camera, yeah. I used to, um, I used to break dance in the 80s as a kid, then remember Boom Bomb? Well, yeah, of course. Yeah. Well, back in my day, we owned, um, we've had a Lasonic Boom Box back in my day. Now we, um, my brother, my brother and I saved up to buy this boom box. And it was, um, it was, um, how do you call it? $150 to buy it. This was in 1984. Yeah, I remember those days. That's a, yeah, for the whole block. <laughs> But LA, of course, telling you, great. I'm gonna go show you the boom box that I used to have. Lashonic. I'll just go to eBay. No, I'm not really sure. But I mean, there's all there's all the Lashonic boom box for sale. Boom box. Uh, did I used to? Yeah, well, it's not like these that I owned, but I mean, this was a more, um, well, these are like the newer school, but it's like, it's like, it looks like a retro. I mean, what did I used to own back then? This is like, it's, this is like the one that I used to have. The heck? Look at this guy. Asking ten thousand dollars for it.
You know, it's funny because I had it. I had one like this before. I had one just like this one. And they like the, the speakers like this and everything. Actually, no, it's a little different. It's not the same. That's similar, though. It's pretty similar to the one that I used to have. Hmm. It's a different, though. That one's a little similar, but it's not the same. So, this boom box. I'm not sure where. Well, anyway, it's like the one that we used to. It's like the one that we used to have, you know. You were born and raised in Los Angeles, huh? Been also in every city in Southern California has changed. Well, yeah. Naturally, it's just not the same. I remember. Ones with the TV, <laughs> yeah, the TVs, yeah. I didn't really come around a lot of these boom boxes I had built in TV. Well, this one is like the one that we had. This is, well, actually, I saw it. Well, this is the one that we had. This is exactly like the one that we had. This one right here. This is the one that me and Hector saved $150 to buy. To buy back in 1984. But in 1984, $150 would have been like 350 in today's money. But, you know, this boom box was a really, it was really nice. So I, we loved it. I mean... I love the sound. It sounded so good, you know. It had a lot of power, lots of power, a lot of bass, and, and it, it just sounded really good, you know. And, like, the time when we got it, and the time that we got it, I, I mean, I would I rushed to get some of my cassettes and played some music on this, and I, I just enjoyed the sound of it. I really enjoyed it, you know. Really enjoyed the way it sounded, you know. It sounded so good, I tell you, back in my days. Looks, I tell you, man, this one, this one, <clears throat> so far it has six bids, and it's not even working, too. This one's for parts, and it's not even working, supposed to be. Right now, I have a current bid of $222, and $60 in shipping. And how many more days? And there's 17 watchers. And it's five days still. I'm going to watch this. See how much it actually sells for. I mean, they said they're selling for big money these days. I think the older they get, the more, the more they're going to be worth. Anyway. I remember having a similar one in my living room in the early 90s yeah huh and i had one i had one too i mean i bought one later on but i later on sold it for 40 bucks yeah well anyway so what else hi there still the big demand is there Huh. Where where is a big demand? Well, I guess well maybe well for collectors I would think. But see these are uh and then selling parts for these things. <laughs> well anyways, so what else? What else do you guys have to say? Oh, boy. I'm kind of sleepy. Not sleepy, but... Oh, yeah. So I'm just lying on the bed. So... I think I, think I should probably... I uh, wonder what... I think I might have to... I think I have to go somewhere right now. And I have to do something now. Vinyl is also making a combat. Oh, yeah, are they? Vinyl? Well, vinyl, I mean. 
Yeah. Oh yeah. Now Phil Collins is in a wheelchair, huh? I mean, meaning that he had a problem with either health or something happened to him and stuff. Well, I mean, it's all part of growing, getting older. You know? I mean, it's all part of aging. You know. I mean, I mean, if I'm I'm probably gonna be on a wheelchair myself pretty soon. <laughs> but I mean, it's all about it. Well, that's the life, you know. I mean, we all age, you know. 1999 better than 2019? Well, yeah, I guess. <laughs> I would say so. Well, yeah, it is. But, but of course, you know, the, the things that I can do technology-wise today as far as, like, things like banking online or doing everything online to, um, I mean, like to pay bills or this, things like that. Those are things that I like right now. I mean, and then being able to go to eBay, look, looking for any specific thing that I want rather than driving around all over town trying to find that thing that I need. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's see about... You... Uh, hey, uh... Laser, I use mini TV recorder or camcorder. Well, mini TVs, I mean, I, I had one of those too. I mean, they're, they're nice because the cassettes are small. They're even, they're half the size of the, of the um, eight millimeter cassettes. What do I do when I get bored? A Marshall film says, what, well, I do this. <laughs> Like on the computer, I mean, unfortunately, I just go on the computer or I use my phone or, or I just ride my bike like I did over here. I ride my bike. Or I, I mean, these are things that I'll do if I'm bored. I'll ride my bike or I'll, or I'll do things outside. This is things that I'll do when I'm bored. I might work, I might go outside working in the yard or this and that. I like to work around the yard and, and then of course I like to go on the computer. I like to go on YouTube, you know. Let me see, okay. My eBay purchase history. What are things that I bought in the recent time? Um, let's see. I bought phone cases. And then I bought this part that I needed for my car. The Mercury. And then I brought brake pads for my car and everything. Well, anyways, what happened to that, to your Honda Civic Coupe? I don't have that, I don't have, I don't have that car. I sold that car a long time ago. You're the best, thank you. <laughs> I like I like to work on the cars as well. Do you do you like to work on cars? Really? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try to. Well, anyways, yeah, very good. <clears throat> yeah, I try to work on. Well, I mean that Civic. I mean, the transmission died on that Civic that I used to have a while back ago. I mean, this was several years ago, though. Hi, uh, Patrick uh, Hennel. I guess that's how you um, pronounce your name. Well, anyways. Yeah, Delfino says. Let's see. Yeah. So, hmm, I didn't know I had the heater on in the house. Well, anyway. What was I going to do right now? What, what year was that Civic? Oh, it was a 2001? I think it was 2001. Yeah. That, it was a silver Civic that we had. 
Oh, I, I, oh, I think you're talking about the white one. Well, we had the white one, yes. That that one was a 2009. That, I mean, I did have another Civic before. I had a silver one. It was a 2001. And I think the one you're talking about, I think it's the white one that you're talking about. Okay, I, I know. I, I understand now. Now, the white one, I mean, Jenny Lynn wanted to sell that one because she wanted to get that black car that we have. The um, It's a, um Element. Because on um, Jenny Lynn, I mean, Jenny Lynn was using that car to practice driving the Civic, that white car that we used to have. But and but she wanted to sell it because she wanted to get this car. She wanted to get that one, you know, basically for the dog, you know. Well, that Civic, that white one was a 2009. You used to drop transmissions in the rain back in the 80s, don't you? <laughs> really? I'm telling. Yeah, it's raining a lot today. Today it's raining a lot. Major time. Yeah. <clears throat> so, anyway, so that 2009 Civic coming. I mean, the starter had a problem on that car. How do you find your element? What, what do I think of it? I mean, I like it. I mean, every time, if that's what you're saying, I, I like the car. I mean, I, I like it. Well, you know what I like about it is, is that I can use it like a truck under some conditions, you know, like I can remove the back seats. I can remove the back seats and then I can, I can have a space in there to put bulky items in there. Cause it's like I could put stuff in there that I cannot put in a car that I cannot put in a car. So it's, the element is great for that, you know. Well, anyways, so what else? Yeah. You know what? So anyways, so what else? Yeah, turn to, um, well, with the, if you're talking about um, the mechanical problems with the uh, element, well, not, not not right now, not exactly, but the power steering pump is no good on that element, and I have to replace that because it's leaking a lot of fluid, and, it's, and then there's some parts that I need to replace. Yeah. So, anyways. Yeah. Well, I, I I guess I gotta get going. I'm gonna get going right now. So, I'll be back again. So, I'm gonna be, get going in the next uh, minute. Yeah, it's a big, eh, this house, I mean, it's a um, two bedroom, one bath. But it has this extra room, though. It has this bonus room, you know. So it makes it look big, I would say. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm gonna get going and I'll be back again, you know, I'll be back again. Yeah. Yeah, have a nice day, all of y'all. Okay. I'll see y'all. <laughs>